I'm a former teacher, I'm a producer and rapper, I also took my name from a video game character. <laughs> So my name is Anango Lumumba Kasango. I also rap and produce under the name Samus, and I'm based out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. In addition to being a rapper and a producer, I'm actually a PhD student at Cornell University in the Science and Technology Studies Department. So I started rapping when I was maybe 24. Like, I started pretty late. A lot of folks, I think, you know, they grow up listening to hip hop. They're like 13, 14 in ciphers. And that wasn't a thing that I felt like I could be a part of until much, much later in life. So whatever you're into, like, you can take your time. Getting to actually like live out my dream in sort of a weird way in the sense that I started rapping because I wanted to speak to my students and I didn't get the chance to do that and now a whole bunch of years later when I'm a much better rapper, <laughs> I have the chance to potentially aid students in their sort of educational endeavors. So it feels really good to finally be able to do the thing that I think inspired me to do this in the first place. I know you heard of me. The best figure of speech, hands down, hyperbole. The hardest thing about being a flow cap artist is probably trying to balance the desire to have like hot bars and like really go in, but also have content that's understandable and like manageable. Because sometimes the word that's like the coolest isn't the word that's like the easiest to understand or doesn't make sense of the concept. I think it's good exercise for me in terms of how I write songs, like who do I want to hear this? What audience do I have and how can I best relate like what I'm feeling to what they might be hearing. Who inspires or influences you artistically? Kanye West, um, as he is for a lot of folks. Um, he's the reason why I started producing beats. I loved his kind of like chipmunk soul thing that he was doing back in the day. I thought that was so cool and that was something I wanted to experiment with. Um, but I also love Kanye because he's unafraid as an artist. He's just gone through so many different sounds, so many different stages. He's talked about so many different things. He's kind of a chameleon in that regard. And so I also really like the artist Bjork. Um, she's kind of a weirdo and I love that about her. She's like unapologetically super silly and super weird, but also super serious. And then the last people I would say is this duo, this electronic duo called Daft Punk. And I really like them because they were the first like instrumental music that I ever heard. So it really helped me to understand like what goes into making a beat a beat. You gon' think about the world and its history After talking to your girl about strategic graffiti What advice do you have for students who are performing their own rhymes? Not to be afraid of imitation. When I was first starting out, a lot of folks were like, wow, you're really trying hard to be Kanye West, huh? <laughs> you know, and I was like, no, this is me. But of course, I had to like work through that in order to find my authentic voice. So it's okay if when you're first starting out, you kind of wear or try on a few different kind of flows or see like where you fit in. And eventually your voice will come out from that. And then I would say, perform as much as you possibly can. That's the way that I've been able to improve as an artist, is just taking as many opportunities as I can to like open mic nights or um, you know setting up things with friends. And through documenting those experiences, I've been able to see the ways that like maybe I could change this or maybe I could tweak that. Um, so yeah, perform a whole bunch, document a whole bunch, and don't be afraid to imitate. When you need a reset, it means that you grow. Cause living is a thing that your wings can't control. You deal with the blows. The hills and the lows So when you get a lemon, plant a seed and let it go I'm Samus, this is Flowcat And you should always be yourself